going to smoke me a fan at brisket. Welcome to BarbecuePitBoys.com. Today we're grilling up some teriyaki beef tenderloin skewers at the pit. And it's real easy to do. All right, here we have some beef tenderloin. You're going to need some sake. You're going to need some soy sauce. You're going to need some malt vinegar for this. Some fresh ground black pepper, some garlic, some scallions, a green onion, and some sugar. And of course, you're going to need your samurai skewer. All right. Now, the previous video, we showed you how to break down a whole tenderloin into medallions, little steak medallions. So here we go, right? You can check that video out. So we're going to sprinkle some coarse salt and some coarse black peppercorn on these uh, steak medallions, right? Oh, man. You could just eat them like that. And then we're going to go and uh, chop up some garlic, right? You got to have the garlic with the teriyaki. Ooh. And then we've got some uh, green onions here. You know all about this. The garlic, the green onions. Oh, we make some great teriyaki sauce. Right. Now, take your samurai skewers and stab the steaks right through the middle, just like that, right? I am telling you, this is going to be good. And, of course, real easy to do. All right, now, we preheated a pan over our crank grill, and we added in some sake. We added in some soy sauce. Here goes some vinegar. We've got some more black pepper. Here we've got the sugar. Or the terry, the luster, or the sugar of the sauce right there. And then we're going to add some of the garlic and the uh, scallion in there. Right? We're going to blanch it. Cook it down. It'll thicken up. Just take your time. And uh, you can optionally add some heat. So here we're throwing in some red chili peppers. Now, you cook it for a while, you start seeing the uh, sugar froth at the top. And it's uh, nicely thickened. It'll be perfect for basting. All right, now, let's take these uh, beef tenderloins on our samurai skewer. Place them direct over the hot coals. And adjust the height of your uh, grill with our crank. But uh, we'll show you that later. Oh, man. Can you smell that? It smells good. <laughs> feed me, feed me. All right. The trick here is to keep turning these medallion steaks constantly, right? Baste them and then turn. Let gravity work for you, right? If you keep turning constantly, the moisture within the steak has nowhere to go. But stay inside, right? That's the trick. Keep turning. It smells good. We're going to be eating good tonight, Martha. Oh, keep turning. Keep basting. And you'll begin to notice the uh, size of these medallions to shrink, right? They're cooking. They're losing a little bit of moisture. Right? And you want to bring the internal temperature up to about 125 degrees Fahrenheit and let them rest, come together. All right. I say it's uh, time to eat. I told you this would be simple. You want to take a look inside. Tenderloin, if you don't overcook it, and you use this style. Look at that. 